Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Today I'll be showing you how to download and install Golden Maktabatul Shamila. This is basically a larger version of the old Maktabatul Shamila and they also include Al Bahith al Shamil, which I will be showing you. So if you go to www.oceanofislam.co.uk, then go to the Maktabatul Shamila tab and go to Golden Shamila. If you go to the PC guide, then you'll see from the beginning how to install the Arabic language and to how to install the usual al maktab al shamila However, this one is slightly different but straightforward. You will need to download all 14 files from this website that it will be linked to directly to the source. After you've downloaded all of them, you will only extract part one again you will only extract part one and then you will press setup and then the shamila will start running shortly so here i have maktab to shamila running and if you do a quick search i'm going to choose all the books from there at the bottom you see almost 30,000 books so this is pretty straightforward as for al bahith al shamil if you go back to this folder you will see nasbu barnamij al bahith al shamil li tasri' al bahith we're going to set this up like a normal program so just follow the instructions there so because I've already installed al bahith al shamil there's a procedure that uh, won't show on my own so I'll show from the original video that shows the how to install al bahith al shamil so the first this will come up where you need to find the basically the index file so I would press yes he presses no and then he's going to show you how to uh, get a new index after the program opens so now he's going to go to his and insert uh, so here you can write anything in the for the name for the uh, I used index uh, because the file itself is called index and then you find the maktabatul shamila folder so the folder that you downloaded uh, the main folder which includes all of the zip files you just select that So this is his Maktab to Shamila folder. So you're going to select that. And then you will find the folder which has the index files. Here I'll show you with our download, you will go to Golden Shamila folder, the first one that you decompressed, and you will go to this. This is Faharis. You will select this as your second option. So where when you need to find the index file, you will click this folder for it to find the index file inside you will see that the index file is here so he has a different name for it you just select that and then at tally you continue and then you go ahead and use this index search now I'll show you how to use al bahith al shamil So the benefit of al bahith al shamil is you're able to search a lot of books or all the books and the results will be much much more faster 
than the usual Maktab al Shamila because everything has been indexed. So this is the program and this is your all of your books indexed. So you can choose the categories uh, or you can you know select specific books or you can select all of the books or cancel all of the books, deselect all of the books. You put in your search uh, so these are the words that are going to be in your uh, that have to be in your search result. These are words that uh, you it can be there and you can miss it. Uh, and in these are the words that shouldn't be in your search result. So after you've chosen your book, you just place your words or sentence, and then in your matan, or you can include the hash here if the book has a hash here. And then you search, and you'll see that within a few seconds it will do the search. So let's do Allah, and then I'm going to select all of the books, and let's see how it comes. So this is almost thirty thousand books, and it doesn't take that long compared to. The action of the Shamila. So this first page result came in 3.7 seconds and then the remaining pages so you can choose how many results come on one page like this. So you'll see the book names here, uh, the heading of that chapter and the page and the volume and so the files for downloading from this website Altogether, it's approximately 20 gigabytes. You only need to extract one of the file, the, the first file, and I'll just show you how big the file is. So, after you extract it, after you decompressed it, it's 57.4 gigabytes, and the rest of them remain the same. So, altogether, your folder will then take 77.3 gigabytes. I hope you found this video beneficial. Please do like and share with your friends and other students and scholars and subscribe to, to the channel for more videos. Jazakallah khairan for watching.